Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now in today's video, I am bringing you guys a new farm that has released on AVAX. So yep, but guys, before we get into the video, if you could please smash a like, subscribe down below if you are new and turn the notifications on so you don't miss a future video. Also guys, make sure to go follow me over on Twitter at JPKDeFi so you don't miss a future tweet about what I'm doing in crypto and DeFi. And also so you don't miss a video. I tweet out when, when videos are live. I haven't been for the last few days actually. I need to get better at that. But uh, yeah, check that out and go follow me over there. Also guys, go ahead and take a look at the premium Discord server. If you are interested, we're giving away whitelist bots. Uh, we're giving away free NFTs. We're giving away a bunch of stuff in there. And uh, yeah, we do daily calls and a bunch of other stuff. So check that out if you are interested. But yeah, guys, finally, before we do, let's jump into it. One more thing to mention, I'm not a financial advisor. None of this is financial advice. Always do your research and be very careful about what you're investing in crypto and DeFi because you know the drill. It is the expensive, uh, expensive, it is the riskiest stuff in the world so just be careful your investment could go to zero overnight um i'm just showing you guys what's what's out there right so scranton or scranton dot well it's avax.scranton.finance and uh, essentially what it is is it's a yield farm now i know what you're going to say you're going to come on this website and like uh, like wtf is this i i understand it i'm not a massive fan of this home page to be honest um it's okay. It does the job, right? So it's currently about $180,000 to TVL. Now, these guys have launched, been live for about a day or two, I think. Um, so, yeah, not long. They've currently got 180 k TVL. Now, the thing is, is they're, they're, they're not a lot of people know about it right now, right? So there you go. Um, here's the market cap of the token. Literally very, very small, $13,000 because they only launched yesterday. Here's the total minted, total burned, circulating supply, and the new paper per second there. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at the farms that they've got live. Then we're going to go over their Twitter, Telegram, and we'll take a look at the doc. So if we go over to farms here, we can see that they have a good amount of farms out right now. So you can go ahead and stake the paper token for 11,000% APY, which is about 30% per day. Now, to be honest, this is this and pairing your tokens up are probably the riskiest farms in this and probably the stable coin farms as well to be honest um like the well this and these the paper farms are the riskiest ones in here and the reason for that is because you're trading their token right that the native paper token which is extremely risky because when these new farms come out these new yield farms come out these things fluctuate so much like they're up and down like a yo-yo um when they launch there's probably a lot of hype if the project is hyped up and they've got a good marketing plan or they've had some good marketing then essentially what happens is that there's a massive sh you know uh, shoot up in price and then what happens is people start selling they come in here for you know this probably was at like 30,000 plus percent yesterday or something when they first launched um probably 10 times at that actually uh, so people literally got their rewards and then would have dumped the token for the profit so that's typically what happens with a lot of these farms when they do launch. Um, so just be careful if you're going ahead in the paper tokens. Just be aware of the volatility. But guys, look, this is a this is one of the most degen. Um, this is one of the most degen plays in DeFi, right? So uh, a lot of these yield farms that are coming out. So there you go. Now they have an AVAX here, which is currently paying out 182 percent, 184 percent per year. You've got ETH paying 114 percent. Um, Bitcoin 100, USDC 92%. So now we're getting into stable coins, USDT 87, DAI 102%, and Joe 190%. Now these all pay out in the paper token. Every single one of these farms pays out in the paper token. Now, one thing to be wary of is the deposit fee on these tokens. So you've got, um, yeah, you've got deposit fee of 1.9% in all of these other than the paper pools here. Now, also, one thing I will say is let's say you want to chuck in, uh, you want to put, I personally probably aren't going to be putting my stable coins on here, but let's see if I want to put USDC on here, then you're getting back about 0.25% per day. Now, however, there's a 1.9% deposit fee and the paper, you earn paper, right? Now, this can go up and down. Now, if this goes up, then you obviously make more than the 0.25% in value because let's say you have $100 in here where you're going to get 0.25% of that $100. Um, but if this doubles, then you're going to get 0.5% for that day. But then again, you've got the other side of that as well. If it halves, then you're going to earn half that. Um, so just be careful about that again. This, that, but that's the risks of it, right? <laughs> that's that's kind of how it works. So that, that's the farms. Here are the info. You've got documentation and deck screener. And you've got the layers over here. Um, 
so uh, so yeah that's that's that right um, you've got the layers which you can go to phantom and they have a phantom version out as well by the looks of it which has about 13,000 TVL which has again the same yeah the same uh, pools of the you know the Joe token they've got the boo token which is the token for phantom and they have paper to phantom and not paper to uh, uh, AVAX but again you know and, and again phantom instead of AVAX there the APYs are a bit lower again because there's a lot less TVL on here so there you go but um yeah so that's that now if we take a look at, at Rugdoc we can see over here they have been reviewed by Rugdoc and they put them at some risk they are going to have a pre-sale their native token check the project about backing or burning the liquidity token owner is not uh, master chef there is a risk of dev minting and dumping please clarify with the project on the token ownership so be careful of that no pools have been added to the master chef there is a risk of the contract being switched out master chef not uh, currently not behind a time lock anti whale can be set artificially low which could impede block transfers uh, master chef has not been excluded from anti whale which could block harvest anti whale disabled at the moment min five percent um, the good thing is correctly accounted, uh, correct accounts for, uh, for for transfer taxes on any token pool. Max deposit is a four percent. Max is a four percent deposit fee. So they kind of rate it as some risk. So just be careful about this here. Um, you guys can go and check out the rug doc if you want to review it for yourself on Scranton um, uh, Finance. You can just literally go over to here, click info, and then oh sorry, go over to here, the homepage, and it's reviewed by rug doc there. Okay, so we can take a look at the documentation. OMG, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. Scrum Finance AVAX is coming quick. We've decided to implement some changes from our previous farm. The following changes being decided upon pre-sale. We think the pre-sales allow for a farm to stay off the right foot. Check out the pre-sale tab to understand why. So that doesn't really, uh, you know, that doesn't really make sense here because, well, it, it did obviously at the time, but that doesn't apply to us because we're past the pre-sale time. Substa uh, sustainable emission. We have noticed a trend of yield farms launching with emission schedules to set rapidly drop yields after the first day. We wanted to we wanted to go a more slow and steady approach where APRs might look less lucrative, but the dilate uh, the dilution will be much lower as a result. Increased native allocation. While we always believe that seventy percent allocation, you guys can go read this. Um, yeah, you've got the paper token. You've got the pre-sale farm launch details fees. So there you go. And it just states the 1.9% deposit fee on non-native pools, farms here, and we have the roadmap. So listing on farm scan, listing on Coin Gecko farming start third-party auto compounding vaults. So you know which a lot of these other have. You know maybe they integrate with Beefy Finance or or something like that, right? So it's an auto compounder. Emergency withdraw uh, contracts, liquidity lock, time lock, and multi-sig, and you've got Telegram and uh, Twitter there. So Twitter, they have about 382 followers. It's so still not very big. I mean, look, these guys are pretty under the radar. Uh, not a lot of people know about them. So three days. Oh, by the way, I just wanted to mention that, yes, this is a, uh, a paid promo for Scranton Finance. Um, yeah, I just wanted that to, to be known. Um, again, full transparency. I, I, I always let you guys know that. But, um, yeah, so I, I wanted to let you guys know that. Uh, but, yeah, pretty interesting farm here for, for Scranton. I mean, we can have a look at the audit there, uh, paper printing there, congrats to blah, 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 farm launch. So yeah, there you go. Okay, pretty pretty good stuff. So there you go, guys. That is Scranton.Finance. Let me know down below what you think of it. Um, interesting kind of take on a new yield farm. I like the kind of branding. But again, this website, I'm not a massive fan of the homepage. Um, but these farms, they do have some juicy APRs going on. So let me know down below what you think, guys. This is a new yield farm on AVAX. They also have a phantom version. So just launched as well. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a great day and I'll see you on my next video. Peace.